Today, we're going to take a look at a couple of different scenarios. We're going to take a look at scheduling an appointment from a treatment plan procedure in PracticeWorks software, and then we're going to take a look at that same scenario in Sensei Cloud software. We're going to begin with PracticeWorks, and I have my patient, Stephanie Abbott, already highlighted. I'm going to go ahead and click OK. I'm in the phone inquiry window. I'm going to click Make an Appointment and we see that she has a proposed treatment plan. I do need to accept that plan before I can schedule it, so I'm just gonna say accept it. And now it's coming up with the item for the first appointment. I'm going to schedule the selected item. I'm going to put in my predefined appointment description. If I need to change the amount of time that we need, I can do so here in this window. It put in my procedure, and I'm going to go ahead and click OK. And now she's going to float on my schedule. I'm going to pull up my calendar, and I'm going to schedule it one week from today. And I'm just going to drag her. Into the spot that I want to schedule. And I'm going to double click her to go ahead and schedule that appointment. Now we're going to take a look at that same scenario in Sensei Cloud. I have my patients tab. Jane Waters is open and ready to go. I'm going to go ahead and click on schedule an appointment. Here, I'm going to open up her treatment plan section. I'm going to select the option that I want to schedule. I'm going to go to her appointment information. I can adjust the time as necessary. And I'm going to go ahead and say schedule the appointment. It's going to open up my schedule and she's going to be docked to the side. I'm going to navigate to where I want to go to schedule that appointment. And I'm simply going to drag her in and drop her. See how much quicker that was and how easy the steps were? I hope you can see how Sensei Cloud is very easy to use.